Hey guys, how you doing? So we are going to show you how to play a very fun game. You can play this on court or off court. You just got to make sure that you have a little bit of space where your kids can run. In this case, we have Olivia with us. She's my older daughter. And we have Emma, okay, which you've already seen in plenty of our videos around. Okay, so uh, this is going to be good for kids ages 4 to even 10 years old. They love this game. It's called Green Light, Red Light. So, we're gonna start over there on the line. Let's go to this single side line, okay? So, on top of this white line, girls, when I give you the instruction, you are gonna go and try to get to this side, to this white line here, as fast as you can, okay? The first player to tag my hand wins, okay? Let's move you, Olivia, to this side. Now, when I say red light, you're gonna go to an athletic stance in ready position. When I say green light, you're gonna run, okay? Are you ready? And red light, green, red, green, red, green. All right, now you can throw in some variations. You can uh, do, for example, let's go back over there again. Uh, you can add a different type of light, like, you know, traffic stop sign light it will be uh, yellow, right? So girls, when you are in yellow light, I want you to just hop, okay? so. Red, red, yellow, green, red, yellow, green, red. Okay, go back, go back, go back, go back, okay? And you can use your imagination and creativity to come up with different variations, different rules. For example, we have a rule also with little ones that if they move when they hear uh, a different light than green, for example, they are tempted to just run as soon as we say a word, uh, they have to go back at the beginning, okay? So it works better if you have a group of, um, you know, six, seven players. So make sure that you, if you wanna do this with friends at home, with your kids, you know, neighbors, make sure you have a big group, it's a lot of fun. And that's how you play green light, red light. We'll see you in the next game. All right, my friends, so for this exercise or this game, it's called, uh, we like to call it blue, green, blue, green, okay? So it's basically we're working on balance, dynamic balance to be specific, and you can use many variations. For a four, five, six year old, variations with just two feet are gonna work just fine, making sure that they can jump side to side or forward and backward, that's all you need to uh, work on. Later on comes variations where they can lift one foot and work with just one leg balance, okay? So this is the way that it's gonna look like, so girls, are you ready? You just gotta listen to what I say and you gotta jump. Remember, imagine the line is like a little brick that you gotta jump over it, okay? Keep your heels off the ground, knees bent, and let's start, okay? Ready? Three, two, one. Blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, blue, blue. blue. Ah, and that's what, kind of like what we're looking for, okay? You can trick them a little bit just to recover always that balance when they get that trick is when, you know, everything starts working on their muscles, all right? Um, another variation that you can use is uh, if you don't want to do it by rhythm, which is what I just did, you can do it by pattern. So, for example, you can go with, girls, listen up. Let's go with blue, 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 green, green, green. Go. Excellent, all right. Let's go with green, blue, green, blue, blue, blue. Go. <laughs> As you can see, yep, that, that nailed it. <laughs> all right, let's do that again, okay? Ready? Green, green, blue, blue, green, blue. Go. Okay, so this is exactly what you're looking for, okay? We need to work on balance a little bit more with them as well. This game or this exercise is perfect for ages four to 10 year old, okay? You have, you have to have them thinking, that's the challenging part, and their focus, and also on the balance, which is very useful for any sport. In tennis, for example, you are thinking about what's going on with the core, with the play, as well as you're moving around. So this is perfect for dynamic balance. All right, let's do it one more time, but listen. You gotta do it correctly this time, okay? You can always make it challenging. For example, okay, if you get this one right, we'll take a break and get a popsicle. Are you ready? All right, listen carefully, focus. All right, we're gonna go with 
Blue, 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 green, green, blue, blue. Go. <laughs> you just stay on blue, blue, green, blue, blue, green, blue. Okay, last one, last chance, I promise. I promise, I promise. Last one, last one, okay. Ready? Pay full, full, full attention. Are you ready? Okay. Are you focused? Yeah. Are you listening? Sure. We're gonna go with green, 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 blue, 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 green, blue, blue, green, green, blue, 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 green, green, blue, blue, green, green, blue, blue, blue. Go. Okay, green, 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 blue, 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 green, 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 <laughs> and at the end of the day, that is exactly what you're looking for. You're looking for a good laugh and you're looking for them to do exercise, okay? And that's a good way to work on dynamic balance. I will see you in the next game. All right, my friends. So for the next game, you are going to use a few tennis balls. If you have at home like a little basket or something, I highly recommend you to get one of those little baskets. Fill it up with tennis balls. In this case, I'm using regular yellow balls because you'll see there's no difference. If you were rallying or hitting with them, then yeah, use the red ballers. But if you can get a hold of multiple balls like this, this is gonna be worth it. Okay, girls, pay attention. We're gonna play stock pile, okay? So I'm gonna toss balls in the air. You have up to two bounces to catch it with your cone and run back to your base and get them in a safe place. You gotta place them inside. If the ball rolls out, then you lose, okay? Are you ready? Emma, go, Oli, go. Ready, Emma, go, Oli, go. So what I'm waiting here is to see, as soon as one of them gets closer to the base, I toss the ball and they only have two bounces to catch it. Your little one at home might need three bounces. That's okay, I think two is fair enough to make it challenging. And if you see it's too easy, so in the case of these two, it's too easy, then you make it with just one bounce. Okay, girls, we're going down to one bounce. Are you ready? Go, one bounce, one bounce. And you could always give them a time limit, let's say for 30 seconds, and you do the round, put yourself a timer, and then that's how you, you can do it, all right? If that is still too easy, as you can see, these two are just breezing through this, then you do it with no bounce, okay? Girls, now we're gonna do it with no bounce. Okay, are you ready? Emma, go. Oli, go. All right. Emma, go. Oli, go. Yes. All right, throwing and catching skills are extremely necessary. <laughs> throwing and catching skills are extremely necessary for any sport. Um, more, more, even so more for tennis, okay? All right, and that's how you play stockpile. Now girls, count how many balls you have in your pile. And whoever wins won this challenge. How many you got, Oli? 10, all right, in this case, Emma takes the lead. And that's how you play this game. All right, we'll see you in the next one. All right, my friends, for this next exercise, we're gonna be working on speed, and I'm gonna show you a couple variations on the ladder that you can start your kids with, okay? So, girls, you gotta do as I do, and this is also for you, mom and dad at home, try to do it with them, because kids are super visual. They're not going to understand instructions just the way explanation. You have to show them how it's done, and then you do it. So. Don't worry, this is very simple. Girls, we're gonna go first, just with a right foot in, okay? Right, 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 and every time a little bit faster. Ready, go. Right foot first. Okay, Emma. Oli, did you do it? Oli, was that correct? <laughs> you see the reason why you have to do it with them? Look at the difference, Oli. There you go, look at the difference. You go right foot, right foot, right foot, okay? Now we're gonna go with, oh, sorry, hold on one second, come back, please. Now we're gonna do the same with the left foot. You're gonna go left, 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 okay? Girls, when you do this, try to keep your arms here. Imagine that you're pumping them, but you're not gonna pump them. Don't go with your arms down. This is part of running form, okay? So that's also a tip for you, mom and dad at home. Keep your arms up, lightly pump them, and go. <laughs> you can see, we need to work on ladder, okay? This looks easy, but it's not as easy as you may think. This requires a lot of coordination, and you know, once they slow it down, they get it. As they speed it up, that's when the mistakes happen. Okay, if your kid's doing really well at this, you know, 
This type of challenging exercise is a lot of fun for them. So if your kid's doing really well at this, you can give them something different. In this case, we're gonna go with just in, 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 in. Go. Why are you hopping? There's no hopping, I didn't do any hopping. Come back. Come on. Come on, that's way too advanced for what we're trying to achieve. Go, just in. In, 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 in. <laughs> Still, not the way. Well, they're just being silly right now, but at home, please practice. Just go in, 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 in. Arms up here, you can have them pump their arms. Remember, this is meant to teach four or five-year-olds how to run. 